So hopefully you can hear me well. <laughs> Happy Monday. It's the day before a full moon. And it's time for me to open my damn mouth. <laughs> so, you know how people start off their videos with, I don't know who needs to hear this, but they're gonna just relay their message and hopefully it resonates with someone. Well, I'm not starting it off that way. <laughs> I know who this is for. So, if you are a parent, that also means grandparents and great-grandparents, because I know some of y'all is out there, especially because the times we're living in right now. <sighs> Children are gifts. They come with particular knowledge and skills that are gifts for you. They're gifts. What we are doing is controlling them instead of guiding them. This is what Jesus was speaking about when it talks about the overall universal law, the law of love. <laughs> There's many parents out there that spend their time more so trying to control the decisions of their children and grandchildren and great-grandchildren and I don't want to say great-grandchildren because my great-grandparents is like, you know what, I'm going to tell you what it is. I'm going to give you the real. I mean, you do what you need with it. That is the mindset that <laughs> parents and grandparents should have. Children need to be guided, not controlled. They need to be aware of the realities of life. And you need to make them aware based off of your personal experience. That is how children that you have the authority over in a sense. This is how you don't abuse your power, your authority over them because you are a guide. If you view it that way, that'd be the best way to look at it. Manipulation and providing information with the intent to manipulate the child's decision-making is witchcraft. It is slavery. You are abusing your power when you do this. You have to understand that children come from God. And just because we're adults don't mean we didn't come from the same God they came from. So, you have to trust if they are above your controlling age, <laughs> if they are above this, <laughs> you're gonna have to trust that you have given them enough information to make the best decisions. However, you know damn well you ain't got you manipulating and controlling. then you really gonna have to trust that person to make the right decision. That child of age to make decisions based off what you've already given them. It is what it is. If they don't learn it from you, they're going to learn it anyway. I love you.